Hey y'all and welcome to my channel. So this is my first makeup look I've ever done. I'm so excited and I will be using my Naked Smokey palette. So stay tuned if you want to know how to get this look. So I'm going in with my e.l.f. Tone Adjusting Face Primer in Neutralizing Green and I'm just going to dot that on my hand and put it all over my face. It blends in really well so you really can't tell that it's green. <laughs> Now I'm going in with my Amazonian Clay Foundation from Tarte and I'm just going to dot that all over my face and then blend it in with a damp beauty blender. And I did not realize how distracting this band-aid is on my finger until just now. I literally cut my finger minutes before filming this. So sorry about that. Now I'm taking my brow pencil from BH Cosmetics and filling in my brows. Now I'm going in with my Urban Decay Primer Potion in the original and I'm just going to put that all over my eyelids and bring it down just a little bit underneath my eye. Going into the Naked palette, I'm going to take the color Whiskey on the fluffy blending brush that comes in the palette and just blend that all into the crease. Now I'm taking Smolder and I'm just going to place that on the outer V of my eye and bring it in just a little bit and make sure to blend. Now with a fluffy brush, I'm taking the color Combust and I'm using that to soften the edges of the darker brown color we already used. Now I'm going in with the color high on the pencil side of the brush and I'm going to put that on the inner corners of my eye just to the start of the lid. Now with radar, I'm going to take that on the pencil side of the brush and just place that all over the center of the lid. With a mix of 13 and high, I'm going to place that on the brow bone with the pencil end of the brush. Taking a small smudge brush, I'm going to go back into Smolder and place that all on the lower lash line.
Now with my Age Rewind Concealer, I'm going to draw a triangle shape underneath my eye to brighten up the inner portions of my face and bring it down my nose and on my chin and blend out with a damp beauty blender. Now taking my Fit Me Concealer, I'm just going to dab that over any imperfections that weren't already covered by my foundation. Now I'm taking my Beauty Blender and setting my concealer with a powder. This one's from Wet n Wild, it's just a lighter powder, and I'm just going to dab that where I've already concealed. Now taking a flat top kabuki brush and my stay matte powder from Rimmel, I'm just going to set the rest of my foundation. Now I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit and I'm going to be taking Java and Fawn and I'm going to be using that on an angled brush and just contouring my face. Now with a small tapered brush, I'm going in with the banana color from the palette and I'm using that to set my concealer or underneath my eyes to make them brighter. With my bombshell blush from BH Cosmetics, I'm going to just apply that to the apples of my cheeks. Then I'm going to go in with my Better Than Sex Mascara from Too Faced, but I did that off camera because it would take a while. <laughs> so this is the completed look. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will be back really soon with a new tutorial for you. And until then, remember to stay trendy. using the nature. Oh, whoops, I was pretty Um. I'm not quite sure.